This is Coogan Cassis Rifle TV in association with MTK Global. We're at the Summertime Brawl here at the O2. I'm joined by Jake the Blade Ball, fourth round uh, stoppage win of Jamie Ambler. Um, pleased with your performance? Yeah, yeah. Um, like I said before the fight was there, like today was just all about going out and showing everyone that I'm not just a, a one round, two round knockout merchant like I can box. Um, take it as, as many rounds as it has to go. Done that well on the day. I, I, I just picked him off, killed him with speed, then when the shots come, I, I took him out. Mm. You had to be a little bit patient, but once you had dropped him, then obviously the yeah. momentum was with you then to go and finish yeah. the job. That's right, he was very, very awkward, because like, he's quite tall. Like, like, on his, um, I think someone told me he was six foot one, but he was like, virtually, I'm six four, he was near the same height as me, and the ropes in there was a little bit, a little bit loose, so he was laying on the rope, so he was he was way out of punching distance for me. Um, by, by the time, so. What I do, I was just taking my time, just tipping through the body, softening the body up, and then waiting for his reaction. And then um, just coming in with, with, with the speed shots to head and body, a little flurry, and then caught him nicely. Put him down, I think, in the fourth round, was it? Yeah, oh, and, cool, and, then, yeah. Um, and then finish it off. Doc, do you want to see him quickly? Uh, is that right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Get this back up. Yeah. Let the doctor do his job. Um, <laughs> yeah, so all in all, successful. Like I said, you've got the rounds in, got the stoppage, so um, you can see yourself. Firmly back on track now. You've had two no, wins since. I, I understand. Yeah. I, said, I said there, like me and Eddie are chatting. Hopefully, if we can get the English title fight with John McIntyre, um, that would be absolutely ideal for me. I think um, come September, I'll have a little rest now for a few couple of weeks, show up in the gym, and then um, I think Eddie will be trying to get that fight done for mid end, 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 end of September. Mm. Other options for you this year? Other options, but it's whatever Eddie brings to the table. Mm. It's near. I think in the next fight I want to be a title fight, so whatever title it's got to be, mm. um, I'm game. You know, people are obviously naturally going to keep asking you about McDonough until possibly. No, of course, no. You know, I had Sonny, I've had everyone ask him. Okay, that's, that's, that's yeah. the thing. The thing with McDonough is um, he vacated the belt that we fought for. Before, uh, like, I would have rematched for that in a second. Like, it's one of them fights where he ain't called me out it, w between November to when I fought in March because he thought he was going to skyrocket up somehow. He thought he was going to take off after that fight. And now, all, and now after obviously the bit of hype of Sky matching him back on me because I'm back on track, going back to title fights now. Now he wants to, to fight in a big arena again. He wants a payday. So listen, if the, if, if, I'm, I would love to fight him again if the money's right and it's for a title, 100. Mm percent -hmm. But I'm not gonna fight him in a sixth round or eight round to say I beat him because then they, I'll punch the head out of him. It doesn't bother me then. I, I, I beat him and no worries. I, I'd rather fight him for a title. Mm -hmm. Well, listen, like I said, you've got options there. So you know, whatever the best one may be. 100%. The thing is, I, I ain't going to need um, JJ McDonough um, to move on in my career. I'm, 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 going, I'm going to the top no matter what. Um, unfortunately, he needs me to fight in a big arena again, so it's one of them. But I just want to say a shout out to the sponsors. Yeah, no problem. V Juice, Rad, Document Storage, BoxFit, Sailor Limited, New Body and Meat Man. From, these guys are the guys that helped me out the tree from the start of camp to the end, helped me do what I do every day. The blade. Right, so without them, there it was there, the blade. So without them, I couldn't do what I love to do. All right, no problem. Listen, Jake Paul, thank you very much for the for TV, and uh, we'll catch up with you again, hopefully soon. No, definitely. See you. All right. Cheers, Top man. Man.